What is up, guys? If you're new, please don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoy this video. And for today's video, if you read that title, which I don't even know what I'm going to title this video, but if you did read that title and clicked on this video, thank you, because now I got a good title. We are going to be talking, I'm, I don't know, I don't know what I'm going to be talking about, but like, I just want to talk about stuff that make me happy, and like, that's what I got to start doing for myself, making myself happy, but where I can make others happy. And yeah, so YouTube does make me happy. So we're gonna get more into it after the song of the week, which is This City by Sam. I think, I just forgot the name. I'll put the name right here. I don't wanna pronounce it wrong because I really like the song. But the name is right here, it's linked below. Watch the video, and yeah, I love you guys. Let's get right into this song of the week. <laughs> oh, guys enjoyed that song of the week I fell which is okay cuz I got back up and tried again got back up and try it again try it again but um this video if you read the title I think I'm gonna title it a million people won't see this and I'm gonna title it that because a million people most likely won't see this video which is okay but I have to realize that uh, I'm gonna I have to make myself happy. So the content I was producing, it was making me happy, but like, it was like what I thought y'all wanted to say. But now I gotta do what I wanna do, like what I love to do, which is film videos. And I like being funny. So, and some of my videos I'm funny and some of them is bad. But that's okay, because we're getting where we're going at. And I've been doing YouTube for almost two years and I realized that um, when I watch other YouTubers, they're making their self happy by doing what they love. They like doing challenges, mm, video games or whatever. And I like filming and being funny. So I'm gonna, and I like talking to you guys like, and like we talking to each other even though you're looking at me through a, uh, sorry. Even though you're looking at me through a phone or a laptop or a tablet or a TV. So, like, I really just want to start showcasing me more. And, like, I want to do more talks. And I'm sorry if you guys don't like when I talk to y'all. But it's my channel. And uh, I guess you're going to unsubscribe. It's sad to see you go. But uh, I got to do stuff that makes me happy. And if talk, there's so many flaws in here. And if talking to y'all make me happy through a camera, then I guess I'm going to keep doing that. Because this... I like I like reaction videos, but it's like it's not like really what I wanted to do, and like talking and like y'all talking to me in the comments and telling me that y'all enjoy my. I thought that was a fly on my shoulder. Sorry, hold on. A few moments later. Three weeks later. Two hours later. Three hours later. Can you move it along? I'm all out of time cards. Sorry, y'all. I got that mother sucker. But like I said before, videos that make me happy. So if I talk to the camera like two times a week, and you don't like when I talk to the camera, it's okay. You don't have to watch. There might be some people that enjoy 
me talking to the camera and feel more connected to me emotionally. And it's not saying like I'm not going to do other videos because of course I'm going to do the reaction video if it's a good one that I really like or a vlog if it's like really something that I want to do or a prank. I haven't done pranks in a while, but it's like no way to prank these people in this house. But uh, yeah, so talking to the camera is what I like to do. I like because I'm a very sad person. So if I don't have to talk to y'all directly, this is helping me like break out of my shy shell. But like, I, I hate talking to group peoples. I just, not to something I really do. So this is helping me talk. Cause if like, if like a million people do watch this, it's kind of like I'm talking to a big audience. And like, you shouldn't be as scared. Like if you, if I really do one day talking to front of millions of people, so it's, YouTube is really helping me with that and all that good stuff. So aside from that, let's see what we can talk about. So summer, it's okay. I'ma play that little Uzi clip because it's my third day of summer. Yeah. It's only my third day out here. I don't know. Damn. Yo, <laughs> oh, shit. That one, it's only my third day out here. I don't know. So um, yeah, summer is good. I got summer homework. I don't really want to do it, but you know, 10th grade. What is all this noise? 10th grade. <laughs> I have to. What else? Uh, oh, can we talk about the drama situation? I know it's old, but like James Charles and Tati Westbrook. I was going to do a video on it, but like I didn't really want to get in between that because I didn't need her subscribers coming at me if they did. And then his subscribers coming at me and then they both coming at me and then I get a lot of hate comments and then I start I, in my YouTube career before it even starts. So I didn't need that. But now that it's died down, I could put my insight on it and my two cents, even though y'all probably don't care, which is okay. We're going to talk about drama right now. So Tati versus Jane. If y'all don't know, go watch each of their 500-minute videos. Um, so, so Tati claimed James did a brand deal with hair bear care and how she got hair vitamins and how she felt like that was real fake and rude. My bad. My neighbor just came and sat on my steps. I thought I was about to have to pretend we wasn't here. So then, Tati made a video talking about Bye Sister and then a whole thing. James lost over like 3 million subscribers. And then he got back. He, he bounced back with a video. First he made this little apology video, which was very... And then like after that, Tati made another video saying why why she did it or whatever i watch all of them because i love drama but you know i mean who doesn't love drama so then james made a video a 45 minute video and he said he got receipts and he got everything else and how um she lying on his name and so he got all his subscribers back then tati started losing subscribers but then jeffree star another beauty influencer he um came in saying stuff the he said stuff about James like how they're not how James not allowed at his house no more and all this other stuff. So it was just a whole lot. And I don't think Jeffrey should have got in it. He said Jeffrey made another Jeffrey made a video too saying how he shouldn't have got in it and said something to James brother and I'm just like, Y'all the beauty community. Ooh, you watch me burn down in flame. And that's how it is, it's just burning. But uh, everything is quiet now in the community. And I think James didn't really do that. He don't seem like that type of person. But you know, you never really know these celebrities in real life. So that's my two cents on it. Even though I just restated what happened. I didn't really say my opinion on it. But you know, don't need it. It's not important. Another drama is Super Peach and Miss Mulatto. Did y'all see that video of where Super Peach dropped that security guard? Yo, Super Peach, yeah. All right, so let me tell y'all about this drama. So. Supposedly, Mulatto went to jail for stealing. <laughs> so Mulatto went to jail for stealing, and then they talk about it wasn't a real steal, and then Super Peach went on the Shade Room comments to say, oh, I would go to jail, but probably for fighting, but never stealing. And then Young Lyric said something, agreeing with Super Peach, and then DeTronada was on Mulatto's side. She was like, how y'all gonna talk about this girl? When she's not even out and she's in prison, Mulatto 
got out and she dropped a little rap. She only been in prison for like 42 seconds. And she dropped a little rap called First Day Out, which was, it was, it was all right. It wasn't that bad, but like you just was in there for like two days. So I don't really, uh. so then, um, she dropped that, talk about how people talk about her when she in jail, but they didn't say it when she was out. So then Super Peach went on the Instagram and said, girl, we about to see each other at the same performance. Do something when you see me there. So then they seen each other at the festival and I guess Super Peach was ready, but Mulatto nowhere to be in, nowhere in sight in the video. So it's just like, I know y'all probably like, what is he talking about? Just go to the shade room and watch all the little drama clips. But um, Mulatto nowhere to be found in the video and Mulatto security guards and dad beating up Super Peach family and Super Peach family biting, fighting back. Super Peach sister got her rib ripped off. Her wig ripped. Her wig ripped off. And then what else happened? Super Peach was end up fighting his big security guard. I'll play that clip because what they gonna do to me? Kill me. Y'all see that she dropped that big security guard and it's just like, ooh, child, how you how a big man fighting a little girl? Isn't that assault? Isn't can she go to can he go to jail for that? I don't know, I guess they'll figure that out. But now everything is quiet and Super and Mulatto like how they never got touched and then Super Peach went on live talking about, yeah, y'all thought we wasn't gonna do nothing, right? Y'all thought we wasn't gonna do that, right? And she said, Nah, Mama, she wanna show out. You thought you thought it was gonna happen, huh? Nigga, we walked out of here with no, with no, no stress, no nothing. Tell your pussy ass daddy, you already know what's up, nigga. Goodness. We got some room, we got some real gold goons in here. Nigga, get your ass up right here, nigga. You know what I'm saying? Get your ass up right here, nigga. You know what I'm saying? Get your ass up right here, nigga. You know what I'm saying? Get your ass up right here, nigga. You know what I'm saying? Get your ass up right here, nigga. You know what Watching this celebrity drama, like, <laughs> whoa. <laughs> so, yeah, that's just the drama for right now. We'll see if there's any more. Let me see. Yeah. I don't think there's any more as of now. But who's to say there won't be something in the next two minutes? What else can we talk about? How long is this video so far? Okay. I'm going to end this video soon. I just wanted, I just wanted to show y'all how... I want to talk to y'all more and talk about stuff. Because, like, y'all probably got some opinions on this stuff, too. So, if y'all want to drop y'all opinions below, yeah, that's what I'm going to start doing. I'm going to start talking about stuff, and y'all can leave y'all opinions. And that's going to be, like, what we do. Yeah. So, um, that happened. What else? It's... What else is going on in the world? I don't know. But I just wanted to make this video to tell y'all that I will be making videos better because I'm making videos that I like talking to y'all, interacting with y'all, stealing y'all energy. If Beyonce says, hiya, hiya. Y'all know what that means? If you love Beyonce, I'm a big Beyonce fan, so you know. Gotta... Oh, that's another drama. So, well, not with Beyonce, so. So it's been seen. Beyonce was and Jay Z was at a game a couple week, week ago. So Beyonce, it was this lady sitting next to Beyonce, the um owner of the Warriors' wife. Yeah. So she, I guess, she was leaning over Beyonce, talking to Jay Z, and Beyonce was just sitting there. I'm gonna play the clip. Beyonce was just sitting there like this. Y'all seen, I just played the clip. That's how it was. And then the whole Bayhive, Beehive went after this lady, yo. Even me, because I'm 
the way you behave, behave. Beyonce to the day I die. And I went in her comments, comment some bees emoji. So the lady said she getting death threats and all this other stuff. I feel bad now because nobody should go through that just because he was asking somebody what they wanted to drink. But Beyonce did it. It's her fault. It's like, no, I love you, babe. But um, yeah, it's just the lady deleted her Instagram. I feel bad. She said she never experienced this in her life. She deleted her Instagram and yeah, it was real bad. But let me end this video so y'all can get back to y'all day or watch some more of my videos down below. Please, love y'all if y'all do. <laughs> um, I wanna give us, so this week's video shout out goes to my, one of my Loy subscribers, um, one of my cousins. I love you so much, KK. Thank you for always watching my videos, commenting and supporting. You get this video shout out. To, yeah, it goes to KK, I love you so much. Thank you for watching my videos and Hopefully, I'll come down there soon and you can actually be in one, you know, and yeah, we can make it happen. So, I love you. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And if you did, please don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, hit that notification bell to be notified every time I post a new video, which is every Thursday and a bonus video throughout the week, which is most likely Sunday. And I love you guys. Peace. Eight games by skin in a row. Roll to 5,000 subscribers. First roll to 2.3K. Let you guys peace.